Kerry, check your check your check your WhatsApp, Kerry. Check your WhatsApp. Code, 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 code. <laughs> We're gonna um continue the session with the duck. Sorry. With the god. Yeah, cause I'm a god pirate, you know. Um, yeah, so we could continue the session. Them thing we are dealing with in our life, positive energy, you know? Yeah. Yeah, my liar. Yeah, man, up the thing, man. Up the thing, up the thing, you know? Powers, you know? So, yeah, yeah tell, tell a friend to tell a friend, you know, make them jump on forward, you know? Yeah, man. Yeah, man, them there, man. Yeah, man, them there. Yeah, brother. So, as we just say, nutrition is one of the greatest weapon, or the greatest weapon that is now used against humanity. Right? You can imagine you love your children. You have your kids that you love. You love your little daughter. You love your little son. The woman take up the people and man, um, boy or them son and married to him, live in a house with him, so she love her husband. Right? But guess what happened? She go and turn around and kill the same man which she love. And turn around and kill her kids and kill herself because of lack of knowledge. Because of the lack of the knowledge and nutrition. All right. So when you get up in the morning and your kids are go off to school and you fry egg give them and sausage give them with, with bread, whether it be whole wheat or white bread, you see it? And you go give them now, even say a bowl of oats porridge and a ripe banana and an orange. Even if you don't give them no egg and, 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 and no sausage and you give them oats and banana and orange, you know, you poison you with them. Because banana, the banana we are give them is a poison. That's growth, that growth Michel banana is a poison. If you name enough of that banana, it will mash it down wicked. You understand what I say? That banana is a poison. The orange is a poison. You know, the parson brown, the artinique orange, they are all genetically modified foods. Yes, what I say? The bread, whether it be whole wheat bread, they have a thing with them putting on the bread with them called dual conditioner. It gives cancer, it's cancerous. On top of that, no, the, the, the whole wheat or the white flour is pure starch and to break down to acid. So guess what happened now? You just send the youth to school for the learn and then you turn around and curse him at the end of the day. So boy, you don't like what? You go to school and me I spend the money for you and you turn around and curse the poor kid. Because guess what happened now? The child go to school with a bag of acid on his brain. Hey, Futa, I wonder if you know, say, anybody will know this. Some poor people who couldn't afford sugar and certain things. And I send them people to go to school and give them the, mint, the, the tea without sugar in there. And they could have barely get no, them couldn't buy bread. So they might give them a, 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 um, a little um, buru banana, porridge. Or, you understand, but they couldn't buy the sugar. You understand, they get a coconut and they use a coconut milk and try to sweeten it up some. I wonder if you know how bright them pitney is. You remember, Futa? Some people were going to school and their parents not even like they're not in the house. Remember one girl? She was the head girl of high school in her daddy. A lamp, this girl had to study with lamp and moonlight. Her father was a Rasta man. And she became the head girl in high school. Remember her brethren? A half a tree a few years ago. And very educated. Go to university, go mash it up. Seeing? And they must say, who? No, no, Oh, I can just one simple comment to me say a while ago. Yeah. A female takes a while ago from the comment and she say, we are going dead anyway. No problem. We are right. all going to exit the flesh. You see, the, but, these are the foolishness. Oh, well, I know. Well, I know. So, then, then we complain about Corona. Me want, me want answer. Mm. How do you want to live before you're, dead. you're ascending to the next stage? 
You want in a pain? You want in a pampas? People are fair wipe your body? You want in a wheelchair? Yeah, people are fair wipe your body? And you see the one there now? Our own mouth are going to come down for now because I'm going to tell them this, you know. As Futa call me, Futa when he's ready, he said, boy, Doc, you are real, love your man, you know. But an obi a man, an over man. I mean, tell you this. You see, the same powers women me do what me do and can do what me do. Don't fuck with that powers there. That power, you see, she the same one. She will just get the result. And the sitting them will just screech in Panar. You see what I say? Because this is not Jesus. I can assure you this. This is not blood clot Jesus. So you can't yeah. beg pastor for pray for you in this last judgment. You understand? This is the no, but he did them ask the pastor to pray for them. The pastor now nah, look, cause this them not understand. Say so this mm -hmm. work that the white man is putting out is orchestrated by the church. The of church course, is the aid of white them. supremacy. The church aid of white supremacy. There has never been a war that the church hasn't approved. There has never been a massacre Good. that the church has never approved. When the king did there with the king advisor. And the main general of the army, a member of the church, have to be there at all times. If the king sign off, if the general sign off, if the queen sign off, and the church no sign off, the war can't happen. True. So some people at different church on the door know the true role of the church. Them no know, man. Them no understand. You see, let me tell you. I was hot, you know. I was poor little granny them. I was little mother them. I was grandfather them. And, you know, especially granny. Them captivate them so much. How black people could have been so foolish? But because they were so downtrodden and them only who opposed God, Lord, Jesus, I go help you, Jesus. And him not help them yet. Them still their church has suffer while the white man grab the world and run down with it. You see what I say? How them could have so foolish to make these people come tell you these things and lie to you about God for such a long time? How a man, footer, I go juke you down and come in at the house and come rape your wife, rape your kids. You understand me? And teeth all you have. And I turn around and call your son and say, Futa, you have to come to church, you know that. <laughs> <laughs> You know, see a mad bum buckler at somebody if you follow it. But you hear them, you hear them disrespectful. You know, see, what is number general? And look at them disrespectful. Maybe mother read the comments, them, you know. We don't come to read no. comments, you know. All right, we we're have not some angel on the comments where, where we juke them, you know. And we have some angel right now, they also we juke them. Not read no comment, man. Big comment for this chat. What is man, number one? You know. Yeah, man, so detractors. We, we, know, we know about the detractors. What is now general? Yeah. George Floyd, right? Yeah. Different from Rodney King, his death incited one of the biggest riot and unified movement in our black people history. Mm -hmm. But look how them embarrassed black people now. George Floyd was murdered by white supremacy. Mm -hmm. But then, when we put George Floyd in our church for him funeral day, with the cross over him, Mm -hmm. And cross pan in pamphlet mm -hmm. and them are pre over in the white supremacy. So now you murder that are orchestrated funeral. I see them white supremacy. Why the Ku Klux Klan and the church have the same logo? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> people mm -hmm. now pay attention. You know, you know, warm people and brother, and it's, it's not so hard to figure out. You know, you know, that's so so them spitting a giant flight face, that's you know. Because yeah, there should man. be no church involved, no cross, no fit upon him thing. My youth, oh, your own oppressor for your bury after them kill you. Yes, and if the, the heights and the level of foolishness, the depths of foolishness. But let me tell, let me tell you something. As I go back, I have to make reference to the Bible more time because some truth tonight. Christ is to make the dead bury the dead. And they are, mm -hmm. they are the people that is spiritually dead is the people that is responsible for burying the people who is physically dead. You see, from the life gone out of body, we give them to the dead people, them man. The people who is physically dead. You understand? For bury. 
You understand? We give the people who are spiritually dead the people that is physically dead to bury. That is what Christ means when he said, make the dead bury the dead. And if the people have any kind of sense and them see about the thing, they must about to rot it. But I see them people them where they bury the dead long time. No, them are buried the dead now. <laughs> them the Christ in a refer to. Uh-huh. And them uh-huh. the Christ in a refer to. I see them play a church, the dead are buried in a church. When the man go in a church, we don't know why the man lick up and we in a foot down. When the man go in a church, the man kick and box and thump and beat and say, come out here. You know, devil, you know. You know, see it. So I don't know where the man lick out for because the man has said the same thing where we did not say the Christ that walk, the black Christ that walk, I said the same thing. You understand yes. the problem we have with the white God, the white Christ, the Jesus. You see what I mean? I say. You know, see it? Yeah, so um, back to the food situation because this is the, 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 the trying times right now. But I wonder if you remember exactly when me tell them, say, this I got come up. But tell them, you know. Remember with the one them brought the, the flood? With the and one them brought the, the earth, 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 earth. All right. Yeah, and you tell them about the plague we're going to follow. But then now, the under the COVID-19, plague. is a plague, you know? It's a plague, brother. Orchestrated by man. But God give them the opportunity to, to do it. Because as me say, the people them go follow these people them. You hear what the one I lick out that say? What she has say? We all going dead one day. Then make where you not complain about COVID then. That's why the just, the just white accept it and go dead. Stick a pin. Stick a pin. This is why the white man find it fit to eat black people food first because of people like she. So she and her family, her mother and her father, her brother and her sister and her kids, if she have none, must put herself in the position, the position to get this judgment. Remember me tell she that. Because people like them. Because the white man says, you know, don't respect life. You don't have no respect for life. So him can look and say, all right, black people be dead first. Because how are you going to say a thing like that? Why are you going to say a thing like that? When you have your children and your children, children become grown and say, grandma, and you teach them things that is of wisdom that you, the older head, should have known. When the older head dead and gone through your belly full and your bumble clad craven, I want to name out every blood clad KFC. I have a Burger King. I have a Bumbo Clark McDonald's. Go on, yam, no. Go on, yam, you craving Bumbo Clark. Go on, yam. For you burn up your blood clot now. Because we don't come to put them out of ground and talk. We rat you and we disgusting. Go on, yam. Go on, blood clot, yam. You go dead one day. Go on, yam. You understand me? Go on, yam. We're too blood clot greedy. And when the year man come, and I tell him, say, we don't know if the blood clot dainties of Babylon. Where Babylon said, if we know the powers, I'm blind on the blood clot. I, it's not the only the sick one that go sick. When you are blind, that's why I can't see blood clot, God. Blind. When you're blind, that's why if you read the same Bible, brother, the Bible is going to tell you, say, the priests and the people of Israel must not consume certain things. Because it's going to blind you. You understand me? It's going to blind you and it's going to death you. When you hear the truth, it can't come to you because you're dunce. The bomb clot will put acid upon your brain, make you dunce. The dead is the easiest part of it. If you was just going to dead, so it would be nice. You understand? But these are all the things that comes with it. You understand? Your people where you are going to put through the art here. The people where you are going to ball for you. Your people who are going to moan and ball. Say, man, be gone. And if my mother is there, the man could not harass me. And if my mother is there, dirty bomb clot, bong the girl. Whoever you blood clot is, let me perspective you. You understand? After you see people are try to encourage we black world to live up and to eat better so we can save ourselves. You miss demons have to come out of your little dirty bumble cloth hell where you reside. Come tell the people about you going dead one day. We know that we don't come here to turn pillar. We're just passing through. We know that. But the way we pass through, we have to leave a mark. You understand me? 
And when we pass through, we're going to make sure say, that we do things that is uplifting and encouraging to the younger ones. So when you go tell a youth, say, him fit it up and yam when feel like for yam. And when the acid start riding brain, he grow on the sun, shoot off the whole place. Eh? Nothing wrong with that. Eh? When the acid flying at them head, acid is worse than crack and cocaine. If you notice the shooting will go on at the school, the shootings happens after lunch. The last youth will shoot up the school, he'll ask a white youth, a Burger King then go take him out when he don't shoot. It's not the coke shop or the crack shop, Burger King or McDonald's. One of them then go take him out. Of. So we assure you, it's not that the fact that you're going dead and you must dead one day. It's what the habit that you're going re ground here upon this world before you go and on yourself. The pain that you're going to suffer. You see what I'm saying, my lord? You know, see it? So make me go forward in the thing because, as I said, we don't come for all those who don't want to live a better quality of life. We are here for the people who choose to live a better quality of life. And that is who God sent us for. So let's get back in the thing and go back decent in the thing. Saying? So as we were saying before, when you eat these things that is engineered, that is genetically modified, it causes your pH to fall below 7. And when your pH go below 7, your immune system get weak, all your systems become weak. You understand me? All the body, the cells of the body, when they become acidic, oxygen can't work with that. The oxygen can't work with the acidity. So guess what happened? The oxygen can only work in an alkaline environment. If the oxygen go in there and you keep on put acid, 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 that is why the people with cancer and all them things, the cell die, the cell can't breathe. That is simply what it is. Because the cell cannot breathe in the acid. You see what I say, my lord? So, we want the people to know, say, the consumption of the alkaline foods is the best way to go. When we say alkaline foods now, we are talk, if we talk about grain, so instead of eat white rice and brown rice, we're talking about eating wild rice, eating quinoa, right? Whichever the three color, the three color mix. We're talking about eating amaranth, about eating teff, about eating funio. See, and these grains, not only, not only do they give the nutrition that the body looking for. But these grains is grains where our ancestors used to eat. These are the wild grains that we call the teff. In Ethiopia, I know them still make the great teff bread. Teff bread in Ethiopia is one of the biggest things. You see what I say? It's one of the biggest things in Ethiopia. So our ancestors used to consume these kind of foods also. And these are the foods that we are saying, the people, it is better for them to go back to these kind of foods. You know, see, because these foods will bring up your pH and strengthen your immune system. And when you go around people who have this dangerous virus, so to speak, you won't catch it and you won't have to worry yourself and make them put you on the ventilator and all these things. You know, see, a whole lot of people right now are living in fear because what? Them say, boy, them don't want to go because I can't believe, but I just see the, the level where them depend. Them free, them catch COVID and them don't want this and them don't want that. You know? They might hide from, they might hide from something when they can't see, it's not a smell, it's not a sound, it's not no color. <laughs> or you can't hide from something when they have no, it's not a presence. Oh. So remember, me tell them years ago, say out of the nothingness, the judgment that go come upon them. It is nothing, yet it is so great and terrible. You can't see it, you can't smell it, you can't taste it, you can't touch it, but it is there. I can't tell you that. It's dead. Eh? And it will mash you up. Some people say a lion, ray, 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 it's dead foot up. Me know that, me personally know, say, it's no, out there. Yeah, but me I say, yeah. the fear where the people them have, right? Yes. It shows you that 99% of the world 
mm. is not even sensible. No disrespect. But yes. sensibly, if something lives in the particles of the atmosphere, mm. how are you going to hide from this? The only thing you can do is prepare your immune system to keep it out of the body. But you cannot hide. The mask cannot save you. True. The hand sanitizer cannot save you. Nothing. Because if you wash your hand, cover your nose and your mouth, your pores them still open. Your ears still open. Them say you can't catch it in your ear. It can't in your beard. You yeah. Okay. When you close your door, close your window. Is your door and your window and your house earproof? So the same ear were outside. <laughs> Yeah, the hand sanitizer. A lot of people never come out of your house and catch them. The hand sanitizer lasts only so long when you squeeze it out, right? Mm -hmm. If you ever spray out your house right now and uh, open your door if you go knock off the mat and come in back, the whole of the ear outside already come in already. Yeah, man, you can't see, see it. COVID and it's going, to, never see it. it's, it's going to continue coming in because under your door, no seal. Mm -hmm. Your window, no seal. No seal. Then not tell you lock your windows so, and your door. So, so, yeah. all, so all, all it all work. So the only protection, that is what we are giving them. Build up your immune system and have an alkaline body. You can't imagine how the world are dead from this thing and this idiot girl from where she come from. I say everybody have to go dead one day. Make sure you come out and tell the people them that make somebody hold her and throw a car. Make sure you <laughs> go tell the people them that make somebody hold the girl and choke him. You have to tell the people them and then pity them say they have to go dead one day. Eh? So we got to put we have for the, if we have got dead one day. Why we about to come here? We all know that that is a part of life. You understand me? So what we are trying to protect now, the only device against this thing is to keep your body electric. Because what? 1930, 1930, I don't remember 30 what, if it was 30 or 30 something, uh, an experiment was done and they see we're in um, the virus, viruses and bacteria cannot dwell in an environment that is alkaline. And guess what? So God made our body that our body live in an alkaline. Our body do best when it is alkaline. And the way that our body do best when we feel healthy, feel strong, feel energetic is this level where virus not like. So you can, and when we take ourselves out of our comfort zone, we really get sick enough with that. When we really take ourselves out of where God say we're supposed to, where we back start hurt we, we head start hurt we, we stomach are hurt we, and all these things. That is where the people become now an environment that virus and bacteria can live in. Now. When you reach that level there, eh? if you stay upon the level where you're nice and fit and energetic, on the alkaline level where God tells us to live, the virus can't live near your body. And you, 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 you get this environment just by eating the foods that is alkaline. You see, if you eat vegetable, you get your kalaloo instead of cabbage, or kalaloo over pop chow, or dandelion, or watercress, or dill, you know, fennel. These are the alkaline thing. If you use onion, you get the red onion instead of the, 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 the white one. You see what me I say? Instead of carrot and them thing there, you get burdock root. You know? And you use the burdock root, eat just like carrot. It's nicer than carrot. And burdock is loaded with iron. You see? So the people have suffered these sickness and these illnesses because of the fact that the food that you eat, and this is the science about it, anything that you eat that is genetically modified, anything that you eat that is genetically modified, what happens is that the molecular structure change for any mineral to be what it is. It have a particular electronic configuration. Every mineral have a particular electronic configuration. Right? And when you take two plants that God make with these minerals, because everything you eat, be it a vegetable, a grain, a fruit, or whatever, it is the mineral that is in that fruit while you're consuming. If we take some herbs and we boil it, it's not some trick in the herbs. It is a mineral that is in the herb. You understand me? 
It is a mineral that is within a herb. That's why we boil the herb and get this mineral. And somebody who was having a bad headache and we give them a herb. No, that can't.